just you. We've got new Millilith recruits who can't even stand at attention without shaking. The force of an ancient god's presence seems to be too much for ordinary people to handle. Which is why we must stop that monster before it gets any closer to Liyue Harbor. <laughs> Interlopers are no more. Now we may commit ourselves fully. How are you guys doing today and I would just like to make a quick video today to talk about Kaching, how to get her 100% while waiting for resin to recharge and also just a quick disclaimer this is not a trick uh, video this is not a life hack or trick video that you can get the character for free without spending primo gems or spending any real money so yeah don't get the wrong idea I don't know why people keep uh, watching and complaining uh, about be beginner tips videos when there are when they are already pros and they already know everything but they still keep watching beginner videos tips videos like how to increase your damage 20 times 100 times they still keep watching those videos and complain to be click baited when they already know everything when those videos are for beginners newbies okay so with that out of the way if you want kitching 100% so here's my advice you need to save at least 30,000 primo gems if you want to get her guaranteed because on your first 90 pity hard pity there's a 50% chance that you cannot get the chain that will get a different character like how I got instead of Albedo on the first PT I got another Dilok so I'm Constellation 2 Dilok so how I got Xiao 100% was I skipped Ganyu banner and I saved my PT instead of getting Ganyu I waited for Xiao and I saved the PT for Xiao so I'm guaranteed Xiao and now I'm sitting pretty happy with Xiao so if you want Keqing I suggest 100% uh, I suggest you do the same okay so and also my other advice is there's really no rush to get Keqing unless you really want her really really bad so I so save 30,000 Primo Gems and wait for her banner but if you like Keqing like me I love Keqing but I'm not in a rush to get her anyway even if I get her when she comes out I won't have the resources to max her right away it will take a month because I'm not a whale I do not refresh primo gems and currently it will take me two weeks to max Xiao his artifacts his talents and his weapon okay and I also have other characters to level up for, uh, for Abyss, Abyssal Spire. So, if you want Keqing but you are not in a rush to get her, just keep playing, just keep on wishing, wishing on the featured character banner. Because like, I got a comment today, a uh, viewer commented that instead of Xiao on the pity, he got a Keqing. So it makes me afraid to pull for Keqing because it might happen again to me that I will, I will get multiple copies of Keqing 
and it's really painful if you're if you are free, free to play I don't need three copies of Dilok I'm happy with one so it, if I rush getting Keqing now it could happen I could get like three or five copies of Keqing every time a pity comes up okay so I'll just keep on playing and maybe eventually within this year let's say if Hu Tao banner comes up or Dean Self banner comes up I just keep on wishing and the first 50-50 pity I might get Ching on either of those in either of the future banners so I'll just focus on the featured coming banners like Hu Tao or Dane Self I mean those are the characters that I really really want that I cannot live without I really really, really love the Ching but I can well uh, because we need to skip banners if we are not whale okay have a great day nope but Paimon's sure that we just need to make it with some boom shakalaka let's go gather ingredients time waits for no one and neither will our riches what'll it be today the strongest fighter I don't pay much attention to that sort of thing. Huh. Paimon thought bartenders had some kind of special information source. Oh, of a dandelion wine, I suppose. I thought I might indulge myself with a beverage or two. Ah, traveler. Fancy meeting you here. Oh, we were in the mood for an evening stroll. A few moments later. Captain Kaya is no doubt a formidable knight, but he also brings us more than his share of hassle. Uh, no, no, this isn't right. I should not be talking about his superior in such a manner. If he were to overhear me. But I have another matter to attend to. Meanwhile, this guy is drunk as a skull. 